Hello, church family. I have one more thought related to the sermon from Sunday. I've been thinking about the phrase I use, trust God and hope will flow in your heart. Now, the, the phrase trust God, it, it becomes a cliche. In fact, it's, it's thought to be kind of a well-worn platitude. But, but here's the thing, just because it may sound cliche or it's a well-worn platitude doesn't mean that we should not be trusting God. Now, there's a, a secondary problem with this phrase as well, and that has to do with the fact that we often expect certain outcomes, and so when we trust God, we're disappointed when the outcome isn't what we expected. The reality is that when we trust God, what we're doing is we're putting everything into his hands and we're trusting him for the outcome, whatever that outcome might be. So this week, what I'm going to do is I'm going to meditate on and even memorize Proverbs 3, 5, and 6. And here's, and I, I invite you to join me in this. And And here's what I'm confident is going to happen. As I do that, as you do that, as as we do that, we're going to begin to see ways to trust God, see new ways where we can trust God, and allow the outcomes to be what, what He wants. And in so doing, we're going to find greater joy, greater peace, and greater hope in our hearts. Well, until next time, walk with God.